Hey folks, Lindsay here. And Marissa. Um, it is Vita Day 29. We are gonna do our Q&A that we have mentioned during this Vita. So, here we go. Question from Dave. He asks, what is our favorite vacation ever? I don't know, it's a toss up between when we went west and when we went to the North Shore. Both of those were really fun. I remember the North Shore being a little bit more like vacation-y versus when we went west was more of like, we're just living out of our van. Less vacation-y. That's true. I really enjoyed um, going west, like Marissa said. Mm -hmm. I also really enjoyed our trip east <laughs> the same year, 2015. We kind of trupsed around, met up with a couple of my college friends, and then since we were out east, when the Pope was in Philly, we decided to randomly go to Philly. We also went to Hawaii this year, mm -hmm. and that was a really cool vacation. That was really spectacular and amazing. But it just, it's different than like, sometimes it's like when family vacations are different than relationship vacations. Yeah. Lori asks, how did we meet? So we met the summer before we were freshmen in high school. We went to different middle schools, but we were going to um, the same high school and the high school tennis coach knew both of us and wanted us to play together or hit around together to see how we sort of played and um, that's when I first met Lindsay and then we went to high school together and we were friends mm -hmm. and we were doubles partners in high school question from the chat pack um, it's a random thing of assorted questions Marissa's is gonna pull one out if you could be the spokesperson for any product on the market what product would you choose to enthusiastically represent we bought Royal Prestige oh. stainless steel um, double walled double walled pans they were a big they're, they're our, our first like it, big yeah. expense when we moved into the house the kitchen, we're like we yeah. need pots and pans and I have been nothing but pleased I think I'm gonna say because I can't think of anything else Chacos the sandal I wear them like a lot Chacos Heather asked what advice do we have um, about growing food or gardening when you start gardening it really starts with the soil um, you really just want to jam pack your soil before you grow in it like if you pull up sod or you're starting new garden beds you want to jam pack it with compost so you want to put like horse manure on it chicken manure you want to put as much good stuff in there to start um, all the of microbes. those microbes and stuff starting to come to the surface, getting a lot of worms, like building up that community, because that is what is going to result in good plants, no matter what you plant. And I think the other thing about gardening is, um, it's just gardening. There, there are going to be good years and bad years for different things. Sometimes your flocks will look beautiful, sometimes they will bloom for two days and get powdery mildew on them for the rest of the season. Sometimes... Uh, tomatoes have good years. Sometimes they have bad years. A lot of it is in nature's hands and so you just have to do control what you can control and um, let everything else have that. I, I would say grow, grow what you want to eat and if you're trying to figure out what to grow try for high priced things yeah. at the I mean like you can you, we can yep. grow potatoes but potatoes are relatively cheap even organic and potatoes take up a lot of space. And they take space. up a lot of space. So that's another thing to think about. Yeah, that is our Q&A for surpassing 500 subs on our channel. Thank you so much. We appreciate it. And we will see you tomorrow for some more Vita videos. Bye. Goodbye.